Hello and welcome to Maths with Jacko. This video is all about what you need to revise for the maths exam. And it doesn't matter if you're doing the exam this year or next year. I'm going to split this into five sections that you need to work out, okay? In five. The first one, fractions. You've got to know fractions. If you want to pass maths, you need to know that's adding, multiplying, dividing, subtracting fractions of an amount as well. So if it's two thirds of 18, how you would do that. And also converting between fractions, decimals and percentages, okay? What's what this decimal as a fraction, as a percentage? You need to know that, that is the first section. The second section, percentages. That is a percentage of a number. So you could be asked 10% of 90. What's one number, a percentage of another number? So what's 10 over 60? as a percentage and also compound interest and depreciation so if you have a bank account this tip what they ask you put two thousand pound in and you get two percent interest over five years what are you going to have at the end of it and generally as well depreciation if you buy a van for twenty thousand pound it loses three percent every single year how much would it be worth after three years and a typical question that they always ask in the exam right the third section angles lot to know about angles that's angles in a triangle a quadrilateral around a point vertical opposite angles angles in regular polygons so more than three four five six seven eight size irregular polygons and also parallel lines okay that's your co-interior your alternate angles you really need to know those and corresponding angles right the fourth section Algebra, the big one. Okay, so it's really, really big. If you want to pass maths and get a high grade, you really need to be good at algebra, okay? You need to do a lot of practice. Just to let you know, I will put links for all the videos I've made on these topics in the description to help you out, okay? So with algebra, solving equations, expanding, factorizing, simultaneous equations as well, simplifying your basic expressions, you know, 3a plus 5a, you know, basic ones like that. Right, final one area perimeter and volume that's like one okay that's the fifth section so area of a triangle rectangle parallelogram trapezium area of circles also the perimeter of all those as well and in volume volume of a cuboid volume of a sphere generally you're given that formula at the time as well cylinder you need to know that one and a cube yeah loads in there okay please comment let me know if there's anything you want me to make a video on. Yeah, this was a request as well from Daniel Smith, this video. So shout out to Daniel as well. 